Wow, the Spongebob Facts Guy corrected the official Spongebob account. At Spongebob, when you realize you've never seen Spongebob's backyard. <sighs> Spongebob Facts. Spongebob Fact. In the classic episode Naughty Nautical Neighbors, Spongebob's backyard can clearly be seen. You might want to delete this official Spongebob account. <laughs> Official Spongebob and Spongebob Facts. I know more than you. Hey everyone, my name is Jake and welcome to Mad Lads, where we're gonna look at people who just can't be contained, they're that mad. It's it, it, pretty much. Oh, and here's a quick disclaimer. I messed up. Got stopped going through security at the airport. They had to take my cards out of my bag. Needless to say, girlfriend is not happy after finding out I brought Yu-Gi-Oh cards to our no Yu-Gi-Oh holiday. <laughs> the fact that she had to say it's a no Yu-Gi-Oh holiday just shows that this guy's got a problem. <laughs> but I guess if some punks come try mug him, he has to duel them with something, doesn't he? He can't just be defenseless. <laughs> Replying to PlayStation, if you use inverted, you're adopted. Um, I'm adopted and I use normal. Hi adopted, I'm dad. Nice to meet you, dad. Damn, an adopted child finally meeting their father. What a touching moment. <laughs> this is really beautiful, I I I'm glad we could all witness it. <laughs> Last night, a guy in a turtle costume grabbed the straw out of my drink, threw it on the floor and said, That's for my homies. <laughs> ah yes, because littering the straw by throwing it on the ground will save the turtles. <laughs> Start your year off right. On December 31st at 9.15pm, get under your covers and fall asleep. Midnight will pass as you are deep in a peaceful slumber, and your first encounter with the new year will be waking up, well rested, to a morning basked in sunlight, and a day that's yours for the taking. Hmm, no, I am going to do coke. <laughs> Some people just can't have their minds changed. You do you, Jiplet. <laughs> Yet another thing they should have saw coming. Cats movie. Hey, I loved seeing cats in theatres. That's awesome! What was your favourite part? When they lost Sven. Come again? None of the cats are named Sven. Sveventy million dollars! <laughs> cats movie blocked you. <laughs> Literally everyone hated this movie, like how did they get greenlit? <laughs> In 2017, a party I threw got busted, so I put on pajamas, sprayed Axe in my mouth, cover up alcohol, and hopped in bed. When the cops knocked on my door, I pretended like I had been trying to get to sleep, and the party was thrown without my consent. Two out of three roommates got a citation, guess who didn't? <laughs> like, okay, spraying Axe in your mouth, I can respect that. <laughs> Me using Snapchat to find enemies during the war. <laughs> Genius move, this man's gonna go far. Unless he gets jumped on in the next three minutes or so. <laughs> Florida man breaks into jail to hang out with his friends. <laughs> Is Florida even real? <laughs> like, I've seen this, but it was such a good plan that even if it failed, he'd be arrested and he'd be put with them in the end. 200 IQ from him. <laughs> Where you at? Oh, uh, turn around. No, the other way. What? No, behind you, you idiot. Oh, where? Oh, I'm in the auditorium. The thought of you aimlessly turning around amused me. <laughs> Asshole. <laughs> He's been played like a fiddle. I did it! Me posting one half of this meme in 2020, the other half I posted in 2019. <laughs> this probably took so long to organize, so respect to this guy. This plant-based alternative promises to help high schoolers stop vaping. <laughs> wow, the organic approach to lung cancer. I'll take all of your stock. 11.59 PM. Taking poop, the ball's about to drop. 12am, 
took a poop in between decades. Happy New Year! <laughs> Does this mean he's the only person that's allowed to say, same crap, different year? I got pulled over and my vape was in my cup holder, and the cop was like, you know the news saying those things are killing people. I laughed a bit and said, huh, they say the same thing about y'all, lol. He ain't laugh. <laughs> Uh-oh. It would have been a bit stranger if he did laugh though, wouldn't it? <laughs> Bruh, I went to see Star Wars and this girl is legit playing Mario Kart. <laughs> She's living her best life. She didn't want to come. I see a lot of passionate posts regarding current events. Well, step up. Let's turn those Twitter fingers into trigger fingers. I'm hiring. <laughs> That's pretty good marketing, apart from he's posted it onto Facebook and targeted Twitter. So I don't think that would work very well. All star, but you can't hear it. Although your pet can. I played this on speaker to see if my dog would react. He just went downstairs and took a shit on the floor. Thanks, Joe. <laughs> Joe knows what he's doing. At Dr. Phil. Well, I did it. <laughs> no, these images are cursed. I don't like it. The monkey's paw. I wish to be banned from this subreddit for exactly eight hours. Granted, but we can only ban in days, so it will be eight days. See you later. <laughs> Rest in peace, OP. I'm sure this isn't what he had in mind, but you get what you get. As a kid, I had to wear a brace because of scoliosis. I was also bullied a lot. In sixth grade, a kid said he was gonna punch me. I said, okay, punch me in the stomach. He broke three fingers on my steel brace and got suspended. I laughed until I cried. He never bothered me again. <laughs> Oh, come on. That's like rule number one, isn't it? You never punch someone without first asking if they're made of steel or not. Because if they are, you don't do it. Orca punts seal 80 feet into the air. <laughs> Freaking obliterated. 80 feet in the air. Like that seal was probably thinking, wow, this is cool for about five seconds. And then he started coming down again and was like, never mind, this is bad. <laughs> I haven't showered since 2018. You mean 2019? No. <laughs> He's probably just been having baths since he has more free time, I guess. <laughs> Selfie thread, let me compliment you. Call me Carson. <laughs> you look like a nice guy. <laughs> what the hell kind of a response is this? <laughs> hey, self-aware. So this man in my area took his church to court over a piece of land, won the case and came back to the same church to do thanksgiving for winning his case. <laughs> Not gonna lie, the post is good and all, but I'm kind of too distracted by this man's profile picture. <laughs> if you ever wondered why 60 cards is the upper limit for Yu-Gi-Oh decks, it's because someone once entered a tournament with 2,222 card deck with the intent of wasting as much time as possible by shuffling it frequently. <laughs> these are pictures of the deck box and list. <laughs> Just the picture of these two guys carrying this Yu-Gi-Oh deck like a steel beam in New York in the 1920s is just perfect. <laughs> Interviewer, give me an example of when you've been a team player. Um, once my friend wanted to sleep with this girl, but she was married. And you... distracted her husband with an interview. Oh, wait. <laughs> After being banned from popular racing game for inappropriately designed custom paint job, Gamer replicates the car in real life and parks it in front of the game studio's offices. <laughs> That's so petty, but so worth. <laughs> My pre-calc teacher got kicked out of the movies once for yelling out diving scores during Titanic as people jumped off the boat. <laughs> this is mad if it happened, but I can't imagine it did, <laughs> right? That's too mad, right? <laughs> 
Pretty mad, right? Yep, you know what's even madder? If you clicked another video and subscribed. That, that'd be pretty mad. Go on, you can do it, click it, be a mad lad.